Hey guys, what's going on? This is Wise back with another tutorial. I'm gonna give you a tutorial of Bandicam. This is an amazing software for capturing your game and capturing your screen recording. I've tried so many applications such as Snagit, Camtasia, Fraps, OBS, but I came across that this software does a really good job and so I like it so much. So I'm gonna give you a tutorial how to use this software. So if you start this software, this is what you see, right? And on the top left you see that gaming recording mode so in this mode you go to your general this is the output folder where you're going to record your game and this software is going to save those games there and the next option we've got Bandicam Windows always on so if you want this application to start when you start your computer you can check this on it will start automatically here I've got a really good options that I don't find in any other screen capturing software if you want to start your screen straight away when you start your computer you can check this on and you can set your timer as well if you click on this setting button here you can define whether you want to auto complete recording recording by time so let's say if I'm recording something and I don't want to sit on the computer I want to I can actually apply the time let's say I want to record it for three hours right I'll type three okay and I click on record button it will start recording and it will finish the recording and save the recording at your specific folder in three hours which is really good feature I don't find these features anywhere in any software so that's why I like Bandicam so much alright in frame per second you can define how many frame per second you wanna do it does automatically at 60 frame per second you can set your frame per second so I'll leave at 60 frames per second but bear in mind that this file size is going to be really huge alright so I'm gonna if you have a slower computer you can change this to 30 frames per second let's go to video so video settings we got here hotkeys let's say you're playing a game and you want to record and you don't want to minimize that game you can actually press this hotkey and it will start recording so you can change those hotkey let's say I'll make this hotkey control Z so whenever I want to record I will just type alt Z it will start recording image you can capture the image as well see the output files and let's go to screen capturing mode click here and this is the screen capture mode as you can see this dialog box on the top left as well so in the general the same option where you want to save the file autocomplete recording is there as well in the video right so if you click on setting button you can select your sound device so I've got my microphone blue snowball selected there I can specify a secondary sound device as well which is going to be recording from system sound webcam you can overlay your webcam let's say if I select my webcam right now and I click on preview it will show me my webcam and here you can define where you want to overlay your webcam top middle top right and if, if I go to setting I can change this um, webcam setting as well brightness controls here everything is there let's go to logo if you're recording a gameplay or screen capturing you wanna add logo to it right maybe on the top right maybe on the top left so you can just choose that image if you click on this and then select the image it's gonna ask you to browse that image and select that image and open that so I recommend PNG Swine because you can have your transparent background on that Lego logo so I'm gonna uncheck that effects you've got your mouse effects available there add mouse highlights so if I select that I can wherever I click on the screen it's gonna pop out that mouse effect alright it's really cool feature as well in the options you've got your recording priority you can define whether you want a normal task priority high quality it's up to you guys so let's go back and then here I've got my hotkeys available for my screen capturing as well and down here I can define what format I want to record so if you go to settings you can change that to AVI format which is not recommended MP4 is used everywhere so make sure you select that size full screen half screen whatever you can even define the area of your screen capturing from right there here okay so quality I'll keep that 80 because I don't want my size to go really bigger codec by default I've got this H.264 CPU codec right there but I've got a high-end graphics card in my computer so I want to select that so I can change that to NVIDIA H.264 which is going to increase the performance of the recording audio codec is there AAC is recommended bitrate you can change the bitrate here when I click OK now 
on the top we got this folder this is the folder where it saves the file here you gotta click the record button to start recording let's go to our image you can capture the image by pressing F11 it's a hotkey I've set it up before so you can select which format of the image you want to select output these are all the outputs what we previously recorded so, alright guys thanks for watching this was a quick tutorial of Bandicam I hope you like it if there is any question let me know in the comments below and I'll talk to you guys in the next video cheers